Welcome to Snap-on Training Solutions. This module is designed to help you get the most out of your Modus Edge diagnostic tool and covers the use of the graphing multimeter and lab scope. The graphing multimeter and lab scope are powerful diagnostic tools that give you the ability to directly test vehicle components to verify faulty components before replacement. To avoid damaging the meter, never attempt to measure more than the meter's rated capacity. To get started, select the Scope Multimeter icon from the home screen. Select Graphing Multimeter to measure or monitor a signal to see how its value changes over time. You can select from over 20 graphing meter tests and display options, including dual graphing meter, volts DC, volts AC, frequency, pulse width, duty cycle, and dwell. Most of these tests can be made with the standard leads included with the tool. Here are some optional probes available for specialized tests to detect glitches in pressure, vacuum, and temperature in automotive applications. Current measurements require the optional precision low amp probe. This is especially useful for finding parasitic loads, faulty injectors, pumps, and relays. Contact your Snap-on representative to learn more. Let's select volts DC to graph voltage change over time. Here, a constant voltage signal appears as a flat line with no variation or glitches over time. We can easily capture glitches and dropouts to detect wiring issues, failing components, and intermittent problems. The meter continuously records up to 262 screens of data for review. This makes it easy to perform a road test or a wiggle test without having to watch the meter. Pressing the pause stop icon freezes the data recording so you can review it. Use the double arrows to scroll one screen at a time. Use the single arrows to scroll one data point at a time. Or slide this scroll bar forward and back to quickly access all recorded data. Customize the meter display with these setup tools. The profile icons choose which channels to display. Touch once to hide a channel, and again to display it. To move a channel up or down the scale, touch and drag the channel marker up or down. With more than one channel activated, the graphing meter or the scope can show relationships between component functions, like these two wheel speed sensor signals, or compare two similar components to detect one that is failing. The probe icon is used to select the device being used to sample the signal. Options are test lead, volts DC, vacuum, pressure, amps, and more. At 6 million data samples per second, the snap-on scope function can capture many more samples than displayed on most standard display screens. To take advantage of this capability, select the peak detect function. The scope samples at the maximum rate possible and captures extremely fast peaks and glitches like this ignition spike. Coupling AC subtracts the average value of a signal so that small variations display prominently on the waveform. This blocks the DC portion of the signal to amplify the AC signal without driving the waveform off of the screen. Simply touch the coupling AC icon to activate. The scope trigger sets a threshold value that initiates the waveform display. When the voltage passes the threshold value, a new waveform begins. This produces a very stable waveform that does not flicker or drift. Touch the trigger icon to trigger when the voltage rises to the threshold value. Touch the icon again to trigger when the voltage falls to the threshold value. The trigger point appears as a plus sign on the display. Touch and drag the plus sign to position it, or touch the large plus sign on the control panel 
to use the four-way control for a more precise setting. Easily change the time scale or sweep using the sweep menu. You can set the total time it takes for the data to fill the screen, anywhere from 1 to 20 seconds in meter mode and as short as 50 microseconds in lab scope mode. Touch the scale value to change it anytime with this pop-up menu. After making a menu selection, simply touch a blank spot on the screen to hide the menu. The graphing meter also tracks the minimum and maximum recorded values. Selecting the refresh icon clears these values and the tracking starts over. To see more detail at any time, touch the full screen arrow to hide the control panel and expand the graphing display. Touch it again to show the control panel. To learn more about graphing multimeter and lab scope functions and settings, refer to the Modus Edge user manual. Snap-on is dedicated to helping you get the most out of your diagnostic tool and keep your customers happy. Watch the rest of the modules in this Training Solutions series and be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you don't miss the next great product from Snap-on.